hi guys welcome to my channel it's Njuma here today I have a Zaha all for you guys thank you guys so much for taking your time to watch my video I hope you enjoy the pieces I picked up see you in the next one bye the soft and luxurious appearance of satin makes it a classic piece that never goes out of style additionally it is versatile its versatility allows it to be incorporated into a variety of outfits. This satin dress has been embellished with this floral detail. As you can see, you can see the floral detail on the right side of the dress here, which is my favorite, on this side of the dress, which is my favorite. The length of the dress is also perfect, and given the, sl the, the slits it has at the back, it just makes it easy to move. I am wearing it with this metallic high heels which I also got from Zara a while back and I think it just complements the outfit beautifully. The material is light and it's perfect for spring and summer. This is a dress that you wear for a date night or an evening gala. Unfortunately, if you are going to buy this dress, make sure you size up, especially if you are a pear shaped girl like me. I don't know if you can see, but the dress is really tight around this region, which is rather unfortunate. I had to struggle to get the dress past my hip area, so I will be returning it. It's rather unfortunate because I really love the dress. Other than that, again, the dress is beautiful, I like the embellishments and it's perfect. Wearing an all denim outfit is a great way to create a casual yet bold fashion forward look. I decided to get the same shade of jeans because I wanted to create an unbroken cohesive look that would draw the eyes up to down the entire outfit while elongating my silhouette. I paired it with all black accessories like the mesh mules, the dark sunglasses and this dark denim bag which I got from Zara. I think having such a simple base for this denim outfit make the black accessories pop a double denim is an outfit that works in many different occasions also i have to say i love the crop of this particular jean trousers because it just enhances the cool casual vibes of the the entire outfit and again the black accessories really accentuate and make the outfit pop for the jewelry i'm wearing gold jewelry as you can see the bangle and everything else is gold including the rings I am enchanted by cargo pants because they add a dash of cool to any out outfit cargo pants are very utilitarian and of course who doesn't like handy pockets i am particularly attracted to this piece because it is high waisted which is perfect for spring and summer i wanted a monochromatic outfit that would not make me sweat so i added this fringe bondo top over this mesh top Mixing fabrics is a good way to wear monochromatic outfits and to make your outfit look more interesting. For the mules, I am wearing the same mules which I wore earlier with the Deming outfit and I think it complements and finalizes the look beautifully. Cargo pants are handy because they are not only stylish but they have a lot of pockets so you don't necessarily have to hold a bag, at least for me I don't. So you have these pockets here, you have the ones here and you also have some pockets at the back i decided to add again this fringe top was just to make the outfit look more sexy and casual i like the outfit the mixture of the fabric is beautiful like i said earlier and it is just perfect the mesh heels again just complement the outfit beautifully so my toes are definitely breathing in these mesh heels I have to say that mesh heels and ballerine have been trending since last year 
and I think for summer since places tend to be very hot during summer mesh shoes or heels cover your toes while simultaneously allowing your toes to breathe another thing I like about this ensemble is the fact that even though the individual pieces are all black the outfit as a whole is relatively lightweight this pair of trousers for example I don't know if you can see that but it is a very lightweight material which is perfect particularly for me since I am on the sweaty side the fringe detail also makes the outfit really beautiful rock and roll ish and it also shows that you're not taking yourself too seriously outfit is the typical black and white outfit the statement piece in this outfit is the tank top with the straps and the hook did and the hooks at the bottom I am wearing these leather pants and I am enthusiastic about leather pants during winter spring and fall because they are very soft and comfortable since the weather is still confused i wanted to be comfortable and warm so i added this stop stitch blazer to elevate the look for the shoes i am wearing these white denim heels which i got from zara a while back but as you probably guessed for the jewelry i am wearing golden jewelry as well as usual to complement the outfits these straps on the tank top just do something to the outfit which really pleases me and I think this is a very easy outfit and I think the oversized blazer with this stitch detail over here in white which matches the the, the tank top and the white nails also another thing I like about this blazer is the fact that when you fold it it has this white lining on the inside it just matches and complements the outfit the only thing I don't like about this blazer is the fact that it does not have pockets so this top stitch detail on here just mimics pockets but it doesn't have pockets to keep it in the black and white range I went for this denim bag which I also got from Zara and I think it just works perfectly trims are back again this season i like them because they evoke chanel they tend to be simple chic and luxurious as you can see here the material is thick enough to keep me warm during this spring season the neat dress makes me feel beautiful and sexy because it elongates my neck with this v neckline and it also accentuates my body beautifully additionally i love the color it is blue maybe on camera it appears black but it is blue and it makes me feel confident and sexy i paired it with yet again this mesh mules and this pearl bag to match the white stripes on the dress i also like the fact that the material is not see-through at all which is always a plus and again the contrast detail is just perfect it is simple subtle but it's just beautiful and i absolutely love it this is a dress that you can dress up or down this one can be a little brunch with your girlfriends or with yourself or maybe you want to wear it at night for whatever occasion you you can also wear this particular dress with boots and it will work just fine especially if you're going out at night and you don't want your feet to be cold wearing this dress with a pair of boots would just be the perfect combination and i like the fact that this trench coat has pockets and it has these brown buttons and i because i wanted to keep the outfit on the neutral side i decided to go for this suede and trench coat it is sweet it is not heavy at all so it keeps me warm but it will not make me hot to dress this outfit down as you can see i am wearing this mesh ballerine in the size 
39 which I got from Zara in order to keep this outfit within the blue neutral range I decided to add this blue bag which I got from College Spring even though the blue color on this dress is dark blue and even the buttons are dark blue and on camera it may come off as black but it is dark blue and white I think because this bag is in the blue range it matches perfectly with the outfit I have been a fan of the mesh ballerine ever since they came out and I think if you're one of those people who is scared of what your toes will look like if you don't want to if you don't like wearing open toe shoes this ballerine trend will be the best for you because it covers your feet and your toes while simultaneously allowing them to breathe a pop of color what i like about this outfit particularly this skirt is the fact that it evokes this ladylike trend which i've been super into recently and i love the movement of the skirt and the pleats absolutely just make movement easy because it is really roomy and it has a hidden zip and here i added this pop of color which is this yellow bandeau top and i absolutely love it for the shoes, I am wearing this beige muse just to keep the focus on of the outfit on this bundle top. For those of you who are looking for a way to add a pop of color to your outfit, this is how you do it. Start with one piece and again, I went for beige muse just to keep the focus of the outfit on this particular bundle top and it is very, again, it is ladylike, it is ladylike, it is cute and it is classy. I also like the fact that it has this petite detail here at the front which just makes the outfit pretty. Additionally, the skirt has pockets on both sides which is always welcome. So you can just put your, your phone or your keys in here and I absolutely love it. The quality of the skirt is there. It is heavy but not in a bad way and I just added this bundle top just to give it a pop of color again and to make the outfit pop. A striped poplin shirt is one of those wardrobe staples I can never have enough of. I am a fan of striped shirts because they can be worn all year round. With the spring and the summer season being the peak season for striped shirts, at least for me. The striped poplin shirt is one of those wardrobe staples I will never get enough of. I like striped shirts because they can be worn all year round, with the summer and the spring season being the peak season for striped shirts, at least for me. Here, I am wearing it with these cropped jeans. The jeans are cropped but because I am, I am short, they don't look cropped. And I decided to wear this tank top underneath to just match the overall neutral palette of the outfits. If you are a taller girl, just know that they are going to be cropped. I am 1 meter 63 centimeters, so I am not the tallest person, so for me they don't look cropped. What made me buy this shirt are the contrasting cuffs and the oversized lapel collar and this chest patch pocket which is which it has here even though it's not a real pocket just for reference this shirt is in the size extra small it is oversized and the shirt is in the size extra small and the pants are in the size canada size 8 and for the mules i went for this beige mules just to complement the outfit and again keep it on the neutral size and keep the focus of the outfit and keep the focus of the outfit on this particular shirts. 